Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. In this video, I will talk about growing okra from seed at your home. Okras are warm weather vegetables and here it's very popular during the summer and we love it. You will also know them as lady's finger. But did you know that okra plants are related to the hibiscus and hollyhock plants? Isn't that amazing? So they're quite wild plants and extremely easy to grow. You can easily grow them in the ground, raised bed or containers. I have grown them both in containers and in the ground and I'm gonna share all the details with you. The easiest way you can grow them is by seeds. Get your seeds from a nursery or online. Before planting the seeds, you can soak the seeds in water for around 10 to 12 hours to have quick germination. After that, take your potting media. You can use plain soil or compost. I'm just using normal garden soil. Make little holes. Take your seeds, place them in the holes around 1 inch deep. You can directly sow them in the final location or you can grow them in small pots and later repot them. After placing the seeds, cover them up, press them gently. After that, water the soil, keep the soil moist always and place it in a bright warm area for germination. You will see germination in a couple of days. So here are the germinated seedlings after around 10 days. You can repot them when you see 2 or 3 actual leaves growing. These are around 15 to 20 days old. I will be planting them in the ground. And this one here, it's quite the right size. I will be repotting this in a large pot. Choose a minimum 8 to 10 inch pot to grow these. You can plant 2 plants in a 10 or 12 inch pot. Choose large pots to grow okras. The bigger the pot, the better the result. Take good quality soil for better and healthier plants. They will grow best if the soil is rich. With your garden soil, you can add around 30 to 40% compost and a handful of bone meal to prepare the potting media. You can also make some cocoa peat for water retention so the soil does not get dry too quickly. So here are the plants after 2 weeks from planting. They grow quite quickly and they have really large leaves. Place your plants in full sunlight. Give them minimum 6 hours of direct sunlight to get the best results. They need full sun and warm weather to grow well. As fertilizer, you can add some compost and bone meal every 15 to 20 days so the plants keep getting all the nutrition. Weekly, you can add any light liquid fertilizer like mustard cake or seaweed or banana peel fertilizer. So here are the plants that I planted in the ground and look at them, so big and healthy. Obviously you will get better results if you plant them directly in the soil and I did not use any fertilizer in these plants. In 40 to 50 days you will see flowers coming and the flowers are quite beautiful. They look very much like hibiscus flowers. And here you can see the okras are growing too. They mature quite quickly. You should harvest them when they are young and soft. Don't let them grow too much otherwise they will become hard and not edible. You should water your okra plants properly and keep the soil moist all the time. If the soil gets too dry then the okras will mature fast and become hard. Now look at these. The size of these okras are quite big and they are still soft. These plants are in the ground and they are quite tall. They can get 6 feet tall. I'm having great harvest from this plant without any care. I'm really surprised to see how big they are growing. Okras can be prone to a lot of pest problems like mealybug, white flies and caterpillars and they can damage the plants. So you should spray them with any organic pesticide weekly. I use neem oil and soap mix. Spray them every 7 days to keep the pest away and keep your plants healthy. These are all the simple things that you need to do to grow okra successfully in your garden. Okra growing is quite easy and really simple. Definitely try to grow them yourselves and enjoy fresh harvested okras from your garden. And do let me know if this video was helpful. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. I will see you next time. Bye!